In today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how to set up indicators and alerts in TradingView. First, let's add an indicator to the chart. Go to the top of your screen and click on Indicators. In the search bar, type in Moving Average Simple and select Moving Average Simple from the list. Once it appears on your chart, go ahead and close the search bar. Now, let's customize it. Double-click the Moving Average line or click on the Settings icon next to it. Under the Input tab, change the length to 50, then switch to the Style tab, change the color to white, and increase the thickness so it's easier to see. Click OK when you're done. Now you'll see the 50 period simple moving average on your chart. Let's go ahead and add a second indicator. Again, click on Indicators and this time search for Moving Average Exponential. Select Moving Average Exponential from the list. Once it's on the chart, do the same thing, open the settings. In the Style tab, change the color to yellow and make the line a bit thicker. Then go to the Input tab, change the length to 100. Then click OK. Now you should have two indicators, a white 50 SMA and a yellow 100 EMA. If at any point you want to remove an indicator, just hover over the name at the top left of your chart, click Remove, and that's it. That's how you add, customize, and remove indicators on TradingView. It's super straightforward once you've done it once or twice. Alright, let me show you the easiest way to set up an alert on your indicator in TradingView. So, once you've added your indicator to the chart, just right-click on the indicator line itself and choose Add Alert. Alternatively, you can also click on the three dots next to the indicator name at the top left and select Add Alert from there. There's also another way. You can click on the alert icon at the top of your trading view screen. That will open the alert creation panel too. But for this video, let's stick with adding it directly from the indicator. So I'll click the three dots here next to the indicator and select Add Alert. Now we're in the alert settings window. Here's where you set the condition. You can choose from a few options, crossing. This means price crossing the indicator line in either direction will trigger the alert. Crossing up, only when price crosses above the indicator will trigger the alert. Crossing down, only when price crosses below the indicator will trigger the alert. For this tutorial, I'll just choose crossing. Next, under the trigger section, you can pick how often you want the alert to go off. Only once, it triggers one time only. Once per bar, it triggers every time the condition is met on a new bar. I'll leave it at only once for now. You can also type in a custom message if you want, but it's optional. Once you're done, just click Create, and your alert is now active. To manage your alerts, go to the alert icon, the clock with a little plus, on the right-hand panel. Here, you'll see your active alerts listed, you can pause the alert by clicking the pause icon, edit it by clicking the settings gear, delete it by clicking the trash can icon. Let's create one more alert. This time, I'll right-click the indicator, select Add Alert, then change the condition to Crossing Up, and click Create. Now we've got two alerts on this one indicator, one for any crossing and another for crossing up. Lastly, once any of your alerts is triggered, you'll get a notification pop-up along with a beeping sound, so you won't miss it, even if you're away from the chart. And that's it. That's how you create, customize, and manage alerts for any indicator on TradingView. Super handy so you never miss a setup. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.